Hello Capricorn. Welcome back. Guys, I've been busy, but now I'll start come out with um more messages more often, okay? For those of you who don't know, I'm a healer. The Capricorn. The Capricorn. Balance spirituality and practicality. So some of you are just all over the place. They need to be more stationary, you know. Don't be all over the place with everyone and Don't be mixing your energy. Be careful who you're going around during the um the A8 portal, okay? The Lion's Gate. For some of you who have Leo in your chart, it doesn't matter if you have Leo or not, okay? Just be safe. For some of you, it's your your spirit is all over, okay? Be careful of your environment or who you may come to your house or just be careful, okay? Um, which deck? Okay, let's check relationship. Release your ex. Leave the past in the past. You saw the cards, right? Um, let's see what's at the... Keep an open mind. Okay, let's see what's at the top. It says um, separation. And it says passion here and deception. So, um, for some of you, what it says here, you probably just go with this person just for sex or romance. Or you... Um, it's a karmic attachment, like... Uh, it's like um, some kind of sex magic, okay? So another thing um, what some people don't know, if, if someone is doing sex magic and your person, you can, if it, okay, Let's say they, um, someone is doing a sex magic on your person to get your person. And it, it didn't work on your person, but it worked on you. Okay? So, therefore, you, you ended up in a knot with this person. Okay? It's not the person doing the, 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 the love spell, okay? The sex magic, whatever it is. It's for the person. But the person is, if the person have sex with you, you're also going to be um, attached to that person. And then your attachment, it goes with your person to the other person. So, and then that will destroy your energy, okay? So that's like you going in between or in front of your person for their karma. It's like you're taking the bullet for them, kind of like thing, okay? So your person, your partner doesn't have to do the, the spell the, the love spell or the sex magic and you Capricorn but if your person is cheating okay or even someone your person let's say for example your present person separate separated from someone right because it says separation here so it could be you separated from this person 
or this person separated before they met you and then that person who their ex release your ex to past life relationship in separation so your ex and it's all deception okay so that person that karmic person doing the spell and your person and i feel like they're pulling your energy towards so the karmic is possible pulling pulling your person well because you're having intercourse with that person or with your person that energy that karmic is able to pull your energy probably without even knowing but pulling you so you you'll be getting a drag to go to this person without knowing what why am i feeling the urge or even that's not even a suggestion why would i even think about that like going to this person or having sex with this person especially if you separate from this person and you go back to this person keep an open mind right yeah probably a spirit baby was involved you see the baby here keep an open mind on the picture okay um or someone is doing some pregnancy spell or for some of you you probably um lost a baby there's something about babies yeah there's something about babies see the babies up here baby here again okay um so this person is pulling your energy capricorn without knowing so this person probably thinks like uh i'm getting your person energy but it's not even your person it's your energy okay so therefore both of you guys are being worked on okay from that karmic your person x okay but even if your person x is not trying to do it to you capricorn it's still affecting you so it's making you feel like you should be with this person even if this person is not for you whether or not okay it's confusing Be why because of the kind of um magic was done and sex is very powerful so if if two energies combined and someone is working on someone you're also gonna get the bullet too right because then it's like the DNA, um, you know, like for example, you can, some people say like after having sex, you can smell your person on you, things like that, right? So, okay, let's see. The Capricorn. A Capricorn. And that can keep you off balance too. Because it says balance spirituality and practicality. Okay. Capricorn and Taurus spirit courting, That's still talking about relationship. A couple of things. A couple of, oops. Wow. Let's see then.
so this person is just an energy chance for sex energy chance for that's what it is that's, that's the kind of um it's the truth too okay sex energy chance for um mother there's something about someone's mother okay or maybe your mother-in-law doesn't like you capricorn take it as it resonates okay or take what's for you and leave the rest i also see two kids someone got yourself mixed up into some nasty magic thing okay where your ancestors are out they're here to protect you something about your aunt too the grandchildren your yeah, kids are involved in this reading somewhere daughter hmm. possible too a mother is doing black magic on her daughter to get her kids to get custody of her kids something like that so your mother is trying to get custody of your kids hmm A copper can. The devil. Okay. So this person is making you weak. Okay. This moment you're happy, next moment you're sad, this moment you're up, next moment you're down. Your money is up and down, it's like you can't get a break, okay? Let's put this one over here. Money problems, okay? The devil, this is Capricorn energy. Um, seems like whenever you have sex with this person, you get weak too. It says here some of you have no money it says here okay having sex with the wrong person can also affect your money too someone is confused this card flicked over the Arafant, Nine of Wands, Death, Rebirth. Yeah. So you need to cleanse yourself and cleanse your energy. Okay. For some of you, if you're having problems in your relationship or you feel like you're um you get spiritually infected you can burn um frankincense and step over it that it goes up like a smoke okay to clear some of that like energy to go from your um sacral chakra okay because it says um for some of you you need to pray up for all the magic, okay? Okay. All the magic that has been done on you, okay, Capricorn? Let's see. For Capricorn. There's something about a Tyrus, okay?
Five of Swords. Something about a Tyrus. This person possible. If you know a Tyrus, this person has mental problem. Okay. Um, spiritually mad, something like that, or someone put something on them for them to just go missing in action, it seems like sometimes, like they're lost or they're out of it, or they just go from one place to another, go from one person to another. If this if 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 you um if you're dating a Taurus or you were um Tree of Swords, Judgment. And the fortune, justice, okay. Knight of Wands, okay. Whatever magic you're doing, it's not working, okay. It's not working. And the fact that the magic is not working. This message is for someone else. Take it as it resonates. Take what's for you and leave the rest, okay. Justice, so they're, they're going to end up um, curse their own self. For trying to put magic in you. It's not working. Whatever magic they were doing. It's slowing down. Or, or it's going back on them. Like a reverse. Even though you didn't reverse it. Okay. That's like God. Um, stepping in. Answering your prayers. Okay Capricorn. yeah okay as i said i'll come out with more messages okay more often as i can okay guys remember to subscribe like and share thank you for watching bye